Meridian! I like Meridian. Hey, everybody. <laughs> Man, these intros are getting worse and worse over time. Uh, welcome back to Into the Embrace. I'm Kyle. Snow. With me is Chris. Miller. Long pauses for no reason. Yep. Yep. They call me the Breathing Dragon. <laughs> Why do they call you the Breathing Dragon? What the fuck? <laughs> Because when the... I breathe, it comes out through like a dragon. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard, but I love it. <laughs> Yet you're putting it in the title. Yep, a hundred percent. That's what I was doing. Because how do you not? Like unless we find something better, but like no, it's man, pretty good. Dragon. Yep. yep. Okay. So I think that I'm just because I'm like right here. I'm just gonna do this this quest. It's like a hundred meters away, so or units. It's a lot more to the quest than that, but yeah, sure. Oh, probably, but you know, I'm at least gonna get it started. We'll see what happens. Fuck you! There we go. It's gonna say someone's gonna get their ass beat. Take a look at these wares. Is this the steward? You yeah. saw the thief make a run for it. My back was to the wall, you see? Nice hat. Wasn't expecting someone to crawl out the window. He ran past me, dressed in grey, clutching the sword. That's all I saw. By the His sun, hat looks my like heart nearly seized up. Wings, like people would put on like their hair. Yeah, yeah. like in Style. like the two thousands. The high schoolers, yeah. Yeah. Guys, look at how cool we look. Of blood away. It was like until that point it was a clean getaway. I maybe got he got cut on a window or something, but more blood. I'm still on the trail. Wait, what did that say? Talk to what? Oh, this is just that guy. I don't give a fuck about him right now. He can go piss on the floor somewhere. Whoa, did I just hear that right? That's what comes from letting women lead? That's some blatant sexism yep. right there. Yep, totally. Thank you. Here we go. Did someone run past here, holding a sword? Sure did. He grabbed some linen off the stand here and took off down the stairs behind you. He was bleeding, so maybe he needed a binding. Blast it! That was expensive cloth. I can't believe I paid for that thief's bandage. Oh, God. Well, it's starting to turn into night. Somewhere up north. If the thief came this way, there's only one way he could have gone. Forward. I mean, yeah. No sign of the thief. Someone must have seen him go by. May as well grab my free shards. Did you see anyone run through here? He would have been holding a sword. Yeah. Almost crashed into me, too. He ran down the parapet here and went down the lift. No way you'll catch him now. I didn't see a sword, though. He wasn't carrying anything. Not a damn thing. Just ran like his ass was on fire. The thief must have ditched the sword. The Back the way that we came. Maybe he had help. That merchant stall would have been a convenient drop-off. Alright. I, like, I feel like Sherlock right now, dude. I mean... I'm thinking more like NCIS or like Criminal Minds, but yeah, sure. It looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. I had nothing to do with this. Okay, that doesn't sound we'll suspicious at all. I the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. There's more to this. You've got a reputation for showing How do I have a reputation? So I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. It's going to be sold, but not for profit. 
The shards will go to people in need. You expect me to believe that? I can prove it. Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. That doesn't... Okay, Robin Hood. Convince you, come right back with the guards. <laughs> That's what I always thought too, wouldn't it? It wouldn't matter if you did. I'd find you. But all right, I'll check out the water mill. Okay. Guess I should go to this water mill then to find out what's going on. My thing is like, yeah, okay, you're stealing from the rich, but that doesn't make it good. Like, it's not a good yeah. thing. Yeah, like in Robin Hood, it was fine. Oh, also, I fucking love this music. But in Robin Hood, it was fine because they were being taxed unfairly. So mm. they were stealing the tax money back. Sure. Yeah. Right, like he also said robbing the rich to give to the poor. But it was because, like, the whole jam there was, like, Robin of Loxley was the rightful leader of that area or whatever. He went off to fight in the crusade to King Richard, and when he was gone, the Sheriff of Nottingham came in and totally fucked everything. And then when he came back, he was like, hey, we're not going to do things anymore. And they were like, nah, you're totally, we're still going to do shit like this. And he's like, alright, well fuck you then. If you're giving them ridiculous taxes, I'm taking it back from you. That was like a noble cause, because he was just, like, the Sheriff of Nottingham was corrupt af. But in this case, just these people have more money, because fuck capitalism, I guess, is the idea. It's like, like, I forget how this plays out, but, like, still, like, you're stealing, the only reason being the guy's rich, really. Yeah. If you stole money from somebody who, like, yeah, like a tax situation or whatever, like, I would be a little bit more inclined to be okay with it, but... Like, it's still scumbaggy. Okay, I didn't even realize there was a lower part to Meridian here. Arrested two for disorderly conduct last night. You don't want to know what they were doing. They were fucking. They were definitely fucking. Metal bot here, good prices, fair prices. All right, what do you got? Smiling Rannon. prices for machine parts under the Mesa. No tithes to the Sun Court. Not like those greedy snarls upside. She's not interested in taxes. I know what she's not interested in. As I was saying, no better offer for snap ball lenses. I'd give my oath on it. By the sun, don't start spitting in your palm. Huntress, I apologize on behalf of my partner. Silent partner. <laughs> it's not very silent. If the sun would only grant my prayers. Never mind snap more lenses, Huntress. There's no bucket for those. Although you know what a sound partner is, right? Though, no. you'd be well yes. Rewarded for. Okay. Just want to make sure. A pun. Yeah. I figured, but I just want to make sure. Yeah, somebody who, uh, for those of you who don't know, somebody who has so uh, stake uh, in a company, for a snap like an ownership share, good, but they stuff. don't have any we control over the business. Anything. Where do you think we are? Some trading post with sawdust on the floor? This yep. is very, very similar to an investor. Culture. I know culture. Just the other day I was watching the hunting trials. Oh, great sun, lend me the strength of midday. The sun's baked your head if you think we'll shift long leg lenses at a time like this. Uh. Hello? I've told you as many times as the spire is tall, craft and artisanship is who we are. Craft doesn't win a war or keep the machines from your farms. What you need is good, old-fashioned, plain... Oh, yes. Old-fashioned, plain, hammered work. If ever something glittered, you'd throw it back. If Karja had built that elevator, they would have stopped at a good-looking shaft. All those years of delving, and you never found a sense of humor. These guys are fucking weird. Enough! Well? They're a blunt people, the Nora. Why do you two even work together if you can't agree on anything? <sighs> it's a symbolic gesture. No tithes to the Sun Court, like I said in the beginning, Renine. 
Just... just tell me which part you want. A long leg lens. A snap ma lens. Fine. I can see that you're busy. Wait, wait! You drove her off. Snap ma lens, what do you say? I drove her off? <laughs> That's rich. Listen, Huntress, long leg lens. Hunters, scroungers, These guys are the worst. <laughs> scroungers? What kind of brutes are you trying to attract? We were agreed. I do the calling, the, you do the count. The I worst businessers. I... Working hard? Keep it up. Can I? Yeah, okay. Alright, we're heading towards the water mill. Across the yeah, water, just, apparently. You can go over the ridge here. I think that's the reason why I did that. Or, you know, you can swim. Yeah. Fuck it. Shortest distance between. Yeah, Splinter Ridge Ridgewood for the most part. Shortest distance between two points. I recently points ran out of Ridgewood. I couldn't believe it. Wait, what? I'll find a use yeah. for you. But then you could just buy Ridgewood for like, I bought like for like two hundred shards. I bought like thirty four hundred pieces of Ridgewood. And I was like, okay, cool. Like, yeah, but like just because I had, I probably because like I've been going through like all the different side stuff, right? So I did a whole the corruption areas, and man. Some of them are hard as shit, like you're just firing arrows. I probably had about a, like an hour and a half battle with one of them. That's a it's crazy. It's a long fight. Yep. I was told to expect you, Aloy. I suppose you want answers. Well, it's not complicated. We collect valuable objects from people who don't need them, sell them for shards, and use the money to help the needy at Sunfall. You mean you steal? If you want to call it that. Yes! It's because that's what it fucking is! For generations. Ravon didn't seem like a hog to me. He stinks just like the rest of them. Of wealth and contentment. While people beneath him suffer. Sounds like you're generalizing a little bit too much without actually... Like, I'm all for exactly helping the needy, shards, but like... Yeah. Not, not the that bastards way. in the fortress. Well, no. We use the shards to make sure the poor in Shadowside get to eat. Or bandage their wounds. They only went west because they had to. Trust me, I know. My wife was chained up with a bunch of servants and herded with them. They starved to death, still bound together. I'm... I'm sorry. So am I. Where's the sword now? Safe. I haven't sold it yet. You're not going to. What do you expect me to do now? Walk away? I was hoping you'd help us. They say you can track like a stalker. Well, my partner, Nassan, disappeared near the branded shore. He was bound for Sunfall, along with an entire shipment of food. If you found that, you'd be helping a lot of people. I'll consider it. But only if you return the sword to Ravon. I knew you were gonna say that. Fine, I'll return the damn blade. Nassan was supposed to meet his contact at an old campfire on the fork near That's the branded fair. shore. Start looking there. Yeah. But you're still gonna help the needy. Lots of machines out there. But the and guy gets lots the sword of back. And not yeah. the needy kind, but they're tormentors. We all have our place in the order of things. Okay. Oh, somebody's here. That's weird. Uh, yeah. Hang on a second. We're back! Sort of. Sorry, so everybody. Somebody was at my door. I don't doing the Robin the Rich quest, personally. Not yet. No? Okay. Well, we I got mean, some... you, you had a plan to help Aaron, you said. Yeah, and we, we did, like, we got the sword back, so that's the important part of that, right? What do you do the Robin the Rich one? It's just, it's, it's, uh... There's another I remember, King. it's a little difficult. Oh, man. I kind of want to do this bandit camp. <laughs> We're going to do the bandit no camp. Again. Hell yeah, dude! And then we'll we'll go to um, we'll do this bandit camp, and then we'll go. Oh, to... and there's a f oh, dude. There's literally a campfire right there. Where is the bandit camp? Oh, it's right here. I think you already did this one, dude. 
No. But I think you just forgot to talk to him after. Oh, I totally did. Okay, well, I need to do that anyway. Mm hmm. That's exactly what happened, because I just didn't talk to Nil afterwards. Because I didn't have it highlighted, I just, like, went and did it while the quest was still highlighted. Mm hmm. Okay, well, mistakes were made. That's fine. Sorry, right, we get to see our boy Nil again. That's My fucking matters. boy Nil! You didn't like him at first. No, I said I didn't trust him. That was totally legitimate. Still don't trust him? I mean, entirely no. He's clearly a murderous psychopath, but he's found a way to get around it. He's like Dexter. That's true. He really is like Dexter, actually. Yeah, I know. Remember how the blood pounded in your ears? They'll ring later. In the calm. Okay, weird guy. From your inner desires. Or a cry for help. I wouldn't fight it. I can tell. Yeah. <laughs> so you used to be a soldier. You fought for the Karja? Oh, for them, against them. An empire always finds its wars. You can't be picky. The new king of Vod saw things differently. Called an investigation into war crimes. Aren't all wars a crime to someone? Still, I raised my hand and volunteered. You volunteered to investigate? No, I volunteered my confession. No sense wasting time with an investigation. I was sent to Sunstone Rock for two years. The Is that free. like a prison? Yes. But she'll be able to find out here in a sec. What were yeah. these things you did, Nil? Acceptable things, under the circumstances. <laughs> Acceptable to who? To me. I don't make decisions. Let's just say the rules of engagement suited me. But rules are important. A structure cage. Otherwise, you know of those places, lonely places where people once were? Now just a hole cut in the world. Chances are, I was there before. They sent you to a rock for two years? Is this some kind of Karja ritual? No, no, Sunstone Rock is a prison, south of Meridian, south of the rain gathers. Our new son king is in rehabilitation. You can't go on. In the heat of a stone cell in the dark, I learned to focus on what was truly important to me. Have you found a new partner yet? I thought we were partners. I have my own roads to follow, Nil. And they seem to lead back to bandits. That works for me. I'm not suggesting a Karja wedding. I'm never lonely where there's killing to be done. Fucking <laughs> Nil. Time to move on. A brief encounter for us, but the end for them. They were squalid lives anyway. Such a weirdo. <clears throat> Alright. Let's, uh... Head towards Red Ridge Pass. This is about the closest I'm gonna be able to get. Yeah, as soon as I find that fox thing, I'm gonna have to, uh... We have to try to get that golden fast travel pack or whatever. That seems like the move. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good move. That that's a rabbit. Okay. <laughs> Wouldn't that have been really funny if it was just like immediate, uh, immediate fox? Wouldn't that have been nice? All right. Let's see how many times I get distracted on the way there, or murdered. Nineteen percent off of that one. It seems like I'm getting better draws out of the medicinal stuff. Also, something's over here. Long leg. 
Oh. Hello. Glenhawks. Okay, I think I found our weak spot. Dude, there's our body's weak spot. I don't know, man, these things seem pretty strong. Also, oh, aerial strong. combat is not my fucking. You need to pull the right stick. Well, th that time it was. There we go. Okay, these things are. are cold damage. That's what I thought, but I wasn't 100% sure before. Oh my god. I'm fucking terrible. Expert marksman, he says a couple episodes ago. Yeah. I mean, I caught that one in midair. Alright, so I've learned a little something about Glintox. Fuck Glintox. Gonna do a little... I have nothing, okay. See if, uh... So you oh. you'll have literally your choice of pings. Yeah, it is Banuke Ice Hunter, that's what I had, so that makes... ...sense, I guess, right? Mm -hmm. That matches up. That actually means something to me now. There you go. For the yep, they all have ones like that. Meridian. I have like an Austrian one, which you can eventually get, but it looks like the old Ottoman Empire armor. Oh, nice. And uh, it's really good against arrows. It's really heavy, right? Hey, there you go. You can put on your new bow. It's only a blue, but, you know. It's better than a nothing. Damn right. Oh no, apparently not. May have not been for that weapon. Maybe it's just for, uh... A different, a different, uh... Weapon, or maybe an armor. Maybe, Chris. Sucks to suck. May fucking be. Alright. Continue onward. Oh, okay, I'll remember that those guys are cold, so that if I'm ever fighting like a lot of them, I'll switch to my Banuke stuff. Like that time, there's only like two of them, so it wasn't that big of a deal. But yeah. like, is that a snap moth? Oh, perfect. Were they weak to fire? I forgot. Yeah, they were. I'm ready. Gotta be. Oh, there's two of them. I thought that these were the same one. I get paid tomorrow. Nice. I think I get paid the oh, next day. Awesome. Yeah. I pay less attention to that than the average person, obviously, because of tips. But it's still nice when it happens. I finally started being like, a little bit more wise with my purchasing. Like, the point where I actually have savings. I don't buy any video games. Yeah. Oh no, I still I still still spend way too much money on video games, but like well, they don't get that one I thought. Which would three quality condition take because it's off for a really good price. Yep. I did tell you to to be fair. Oh yeah, that's a nice little eight hundred dollar paycheck. Oh. Nice. Oh, yeah. You're coming in a little bit quiet, Chris. I don't know if it's that the game got louder oh, or am not. I, am but I coming in quietly? Okay. Not a little bit. I have no idea why. Oh, I can't. Okay, I was stupid.
There we go. That was pretty good. That was less good. Yep. Okay. I just got one shot. Fucking I mean, one shot. Your health was low, dude. You no, I it, it went, I was like mostly up, and then it, I got hit twice in rapid succession before I could heal. I think. Jeez. Terrible. Well, oh, rip. Rip indeed, sir. I'm very unimpressed. Well. Oh. Pin pin and I mean, easy, Chris. They're, they're only snap mods, man. Yeah. Did I already kill the big things? I think so. Or not the big things, the, you know what I mean. The Glenhawks? Yeah. Yes. Sometimes it's hard to keep track of what you've. What you, like when you saved. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you have at this point. That's good. I might be wrong about that, but I don't think I am. No, I'm already here, so. Okay, those will both explode. Do they have more weak points that I can blow up, or is that it? Mm, mostly it, right now. You can check it yourself, though. I'm in the middle of a fight, though. Though? about to explode. Maybe not. <laughs> Jesus Christ. There we go, that's a tag. I think I got the other one too. There it is. Look at that, Chris. There you go. Fucking textbook. About time, sir. Yeah. We did it. All right. Did you search all those uh, snap malls? Yeah, I only killed two that time. I know, did you get a snap mall lens? Yeah. Good. Oh boy, not a boy. Yeah, I'm just gonna... <laughs> Ravagers, I don't know anything about those, but I don't think I want to. I did get to a campfire though, so I got that going for me. Nice. This seems like a good place to call this episode. With those legs, the machine looks as fast as it is loud. I better be careful. But uh, thank you for joining wait, us. Wait, 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 wait. What, what, what? Is what? that Ryan in that in that machine, trying to climb that wall? What? What's the joke? What's the joke? Dude, come on. Is that Ryan? He's running against the cliff. Oh! <laughs> good, good meme. <laughs> Thank you everyone for joining us on this episode of the Embrace. I'm sorry, Chris. Uh, next time, I will understand Chris's jokes. See you guys next time.